Hi, it's Dominic. If you are into AI images, AI influencers, and the latest in the AI world, you're in the right place. Let's dive in. In today's video, I want to show you how you can create fantastic looking AI morphing videos fast, easy, and completely for free. This is a huge trend on social media right now, and you can actually go viral with it. Considering all that, I think it's a topic every creator should engage in. With that being said, let's jump right to my screen. Good, as you can see, I'm already at the starting screen of my AI image tool. And maybe you ask yourself why we start with the AI image tool. It's very simple. We do the whole process of creating our AI morphing video in two steps. First, we take our original photo and transform it into the transformed result. So we have two images. And then in the second step, we take our two images and combine them with another AI tool called Kling AI into our final morphing video. It's very easy. It's done in a couple of minutes. So let's go. The first thing we have to do at our starting screen of focus is to activate the advanced settings and also to select input image as we want to upload a photo. And then we go over here, select JPEG. We will create maybe three images. We select quality and at the model section, we select the realism engine. This is a special base model, which you have to customize. But as I already told you, you find plenty of YouTube tutorials showing you exactly how to do that. But nevertheless, you could also do that with the standard base model, the Juggernaut XL. But I recommend the realism engine because the results are just way better. Good, that's it already regarding the settings. And then it's time to upload our image, which we want to transform. I already prepared a little selection and I think we should definitely start with Teddy, my dog. So we just select him, we drag and drop, we pull him over here to the in-painting section and then we uploaded Teddy. And now in the next step, we have to mask the entire image. With Control C or with that slider, you can make the brush bigger or smaller and then you just paint across the entire photo. Good, that's it. Then you go down here and you select improve detail. This is very important because otherwise you get a complete new image and we just want a slight variation. And now comes the most important part. We have to enter the prompt of what we want to see in the final image. And I want to transform Teddy into a white little cute dragon. That's why I go here to the prompting window and I paste the prompt a cute little white dragon. Good, that's it already regarding all the settings and the preparations. And then we can hit generate and wait for our little dragon to get created. Good, our little dragons are created. And as you can see, we got nice results. Let's check them out. That's the first one. Really good. That's the second one. And that's the third. I think the third one is my favorite. He looks really, really cute. And that's the dragon we will use in the next step to create our morphing video. So just make sure to save the image you want to keep. And then we can go on with the next step. And in this step, we will take the two images, the original photo and the cute little dragon, which we created with focus and transform it into our morphing video. And we do that with Kling AI. So here I'm at the starting screen of Kling AI. And as we want to create a video, we go to AI videos. As you can see here on the right side, we see all the creations I already did with Kling AI. As you can see, there are a lot because it's, in my opinion, the best AI video tool out there and I do a lot of videos with it. So you can do a lot of stuff. And also here on the left side, you see we have a lot of options like text to video, image to video, lip sync, and so much more. I already created several other tutorials about Kling AI, so make sure to check them out as well. But today we use exactly that feature, image to video and then we click here to frames because we want to define two frames the starting frame of our video and the final frame of our video and this together combined will be our morphing video it sounds difficult but you see it's very very easy we just have to go to the folder where we save the original photo and the transformed photo and then we upload them just click on the original photo and with drag and drop, you can just place it in that window. Then it's important to define that image as start because this is the start of our video. And then we go over to end. And now we just do the same with the second image with our cute little dragon. We pull it over and we upload it. And this together defines now the beginning of our video and the end. And this combined allows us to create morphing videos. Now there are just a few steps missing. Of course, we have to enter a prompt 
and I go with a dog morphing into a little white dragon. That's it. Keep it very simple in that prompting window. If you use too complicated prompts, you get bad results. Then we scroll down here. You can ignore that. Make sure to select the professional mode. Go with five seconds and I recommend you to only generate one video. So in case it doesn't turn out good, you can still adjust the prompt or take another image and do it again without burning too much credits. Then we scroll down to the very end. And here in the negative prompt, I recommend you to enter something like bad quality or abstract, just to make sure that we get the best quality possible. Good, that's it. And then we can hit generate. This will take a couple of minutes now, but I come back to you when this is done. Finally, here is the result. Look how beautiful that video turned out and how perfect we transformed Teddy into a white little cute dragon. You see, it worked absolutely perfect and we did it with just a couple of clicks in a couple of minutes. And you can do that with literally anything. Just take a photo of whatever you want turn it into a transformed image, then take the images to Kling AI and turn them into a morphing video. I blend in some more morphing videos I did so that you get an idea what you actually can do with that. It's very powerful and the only limit is your imagination. That's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it and you got a lot of value out of it. If so, make sure to leave a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and let me know in the comments which was your craziest AI transformation so far. I hope we see each other in the next video. Take care and goodbye.